video, I'm going to be doing a 24-hour glow up with me transformation. I've been sick recently, so I kind of just wanted to do something to make myself feel a little bit better. So I thought it would be super fun. I don't have any work to go today, but I have a list of just different things I want to do. I want to do self-tanning, which I rarely ever do. I want to do my face, so like skincare. I'm going to do my makeup. I'm going to do something to my hair because my hair is feeling a little ratchet today. So I need to do something to my hair. I also want to do my nails, pick out a cute outfit, take some Instagram pictures outside. Because like I said, I don't really have anywhere to go today. So I'm just kind of going to be getting ready at home. But I thought it would be super fun to do because I've wanted to do one of these videos. And I really like seeing them. So I hope you guys enjoy this like glow up with me getting ready type of video. So hopefully by the end of this video, I'll be looking a little bit better than I do in this intro. I hope you guys really enjoy this and I'm just going to get ready and you guys are going to come along with me. Hey everyone, so now I've made it to the bathroom and I'm going to be start self tanning. Obviously, I don't really self tan very often. I don't even tan that often because Clearly you guys can tell I'm a very pale looking person right now. I don't really get any sun. It's not very easy to get too much sun outside because it's like always so, so cold with the snow and stuff. And so it'll be a while before I'm wearing like fun bathing suits, but I decided this would be super fun for my transformation just because it's something I don't usually do. So I have my mid here and my St. Mara's tanning lotion. Let me know if you guys know of any other tanning brands because I need another new self tanner because I'm running low on this one. I don't know if you guys can tell but there's not very much in here. So I'm just going to be doing this and I'm not the best at this. I haven't fully self tanned in a couple of years so I'm going to just like do this part of my body and on my like stomach area and then maybe some on my face. I'm not really sure. And then I'm not going to be worrying about the legs because in this video I'm not going to be wearing shorts or a skirt or anything. I'm probably going to be wearing some kind of pair of jeans or something. So anyways, I'm going to get transformed here. I don't know how this is going to look, but like, I guess it's okay because I can always wash it off and I have church tomorrow. So like, I guess it's okay if it's not like the best because I'll probably be wearing a sweater. I don't know, maybe I'll be wearing a sweater in this video. I just thought it'd be super fun to do this because I see a lot of transformation videos. Am I even getting any tanner? Because it doesn't it honestly look like I'm even getting any tanner than I was. <laughs> I still look super pale. I'm going to talk about my hands. My hands look really bad. Like, just don't look at my hands. Just pretend my hands aren't even there. Because they look horrible right now. I don't even know if I'm doing this right. Just watch me struggle and fail at putting on self tanner. Little. I think it's a little tanner, but like, like slightly. So that's my goal. We're not going to talk about my hands because I didn't do a good job, so I need to like fix that. But now on to the next part of this transformation. So I have a fun haul to show you guys. From Pure, they sent me these really cool like holographic masks, so I'm not really sure what mask I'm going to use because I have another mask that I also want to try. So I just have these fun holographic quick pro masks and they just look like this, which is super cool. While well, they're in the box, they look like this. So I'll try to show you guys what they look like because you can only see them in the box. As you can see, they're in their packaging. Obviously, so I'm not sure if I want to use one of these or the other mask I got. Let's look at this other mask. It is sent to me by Pure, and it is the Purple Pore Punisher, which sounds super cool. And I saw the picture online, and the girl's face was purple, so it looked really fun. So it just looks like this. So actually, I might just do this one because it seems super fun, and I love peel off masks more than sheet masks but I'm definitely excited to try both of these out so I wanted to show them to you guys. I also was sent this awesome straightener by Numi and look how beautiful it is. It's mint green which is beautiful like it's black and mint green and I absolutely love the color mint green so this is like super awesome. I just want to show you guys this because I did recently just get this with the other products and I think it would be really fun like they came all on the same day. So I want to show you guys because I think it's kind of fun to show you guys like what I get in the mail every now and then. But this is just what the box looks like and it's the uh, Meant to be Sleek Hair Strainer by Numi and I think it's awesome. So I'll have the link down below for you guys to like check out these products because they're so awesome and fun and like really, really cool. I haven't had a hair strainer in a super long time. 
So I'm going to be trying this out and it'll be really fun and the color is beautiful. So anyways, I will now go on to the next part of this video, but I thought it'd be super fun to show you guys like this little haul type of thing. And I need to put this back in the box though because I want to keep it like really nice. There we go. I got it back in the box, I just want to keep it really nice like in the box because I think it looks really really super cool. So anyways, I'm going to get on to the next part of this video. I just want to show you guys this little fun mini haul and I don't know, sorry if my face is a little streaky after that self tan because it didn't go so well, it was kind of a fail. So I'm going to be using this hair mask that I got from this brand OMG. So I'm gonna be using this, and it looks like a mask cap. So I'm gonna be using this, so I'm just gonna be washing my hair and then using this. So when I get done and my hair is like partially dry, I will start on my makeup and that will be the next step. But I'm gonna be using this and hopefully it'll like make my hair be really nice and stuff. So that'll be pretty fun because my hair definitely needs to be washed and I figured why not use a hair mask. So I'm gonna be using this one. I'm going to paint my nails now so I just have this really pretty color by LA colors and I just got it it's in Steve life and it's a really pretty like mermaid color so I'm really excited So now it's time for my makeup. The first thing I'm going to use is actually my moisturizer and this is by Glossier. And I love this moisturizer. Some people don't like it, it's a hit or miss, but I definitely really love this. So I'm gonna be starting with my moisturizer just to moisturize and prime up my face. I love this stuff. I use this when I don't wear makeup as well because you can and I absolutely love it how it's like so easy to apply and it's like really soft and I just love it. It's very nice and it's awesome because during the week I don't wear too much makeup like when I go to work and do stuff like that then I do but like if I'm just gonna be at home chilling then I don't usually wear makeup unless I'm gonna film a video but I do love to have a moisturizer on so that's really nice fortunately my skin is looking a little bit better right now so that I'm not like really breaking out so I don't have to wear as much makeup as I was so I don't have to do like a full coverage and just drop something. So now I'm just going to be doing my BB cream and this is by Shine Cosmetics. You guys can use my code if you would like to get a discount on Shine Cosmetics. And I'm not being paid or sponsored or anything, just thought you guys might do that. So now I'm just using this brush because I do not currently have any like beauty blenders, so I'm just gonna use like use this brush. I'm just going to do kind of like my everyday makeup splash a little bit more glam because this is like a glow up with me so I think that will be fun. This is my transformation video. So my hair is drying right now and hopefully it'll be a little drier. It takes a while to dry because my hair is like thicker so it always takes a while to dry for some reason and it doesn't make me see it but it is drying currently and I don't really know what I'm going to do with it. I'll probably just use some clips or brats or something and that'll be like the look but I didn't really know what else to do for my hair for a transformation because I literally just colored my hair recently. If you can't tell me it's like colored. So I recently put coloring in my hair. Now I need my concealer. So I'm just going to use my concealer. And I like to pat this under my eyes. This is the Stretch Concealer by Glossier. And I love it. It's really good. It's very soft and creamy, so that's nice. There are a lot of good things about this, actually, so I love it. I'm just going to add a little bit of a bronzer. This is something I do daily, so it's normal. I'm just using the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer, which is really nice. I guess it smells like chocolate, so that's really cool. I'm not really like super great at bronzer stuff. So I just kind of like do what I like to do. Now my hair is getting in my face. Cool. Okay, so now on to blush. I'm going to use this one by Tarte. It's the party blush and I heard that they actually made this to 
sell in the stores because it was like a sample blush that you get with like I think the Sephora birthday rewards or something like that. A mermaid palette. Is that what it's called? I'm not sure. Just as 99% mermaid. I love this palette though because it's beautiful. It's just really really pretty. So I'm just going to use some shades from this palette on my eyes because I really like it. I think I'm just going to look into this one because it's really easy to do. But I like the rust colored shades in here so I wear a lot of those. So I really like this. I really like this because it's like super simple for me, but it's like a nice color. So pretty. Because it's like all these fun kind of like rust paint colors. And I love that, so it's great. I'm gonna go in with like a slight darker color. I'm just going to add a little bit of a darker color in my outer corner. Now I need a highlighting shade to highlight my brow bone. So I think I'm going to go with this, this one. I forgot wasn't in there, so I'm just going to keep up with this part. I don't have like a refinery thing, so it's kind of hard, but it kind of works. Now I'm going to do my mascara. Yeah, I totally forgot what I was going to do. So I have this Campfire Lashes, and it's like a fiber mascara, so I'm going to apply this first and then add my regular mascara. It has these like little fibers in it, it's so weird. Can you see the little fibers? It's so strange. I don't know. I gotta get them all up because there's just too many. Okay. There we go. I don't know. You can get these level up to like a five. Now I'm just going to take my Glossier Mascara, and I love this too, also because it's pink, so it's really pretty, and I'm just going to go over it with my lashes. Four lashes, just because it's fun, and I like to do it. I'm just going to kind of touch up my eyeshadow and make it look a little uniform. I don't know if that's the word I want to say. Okay, so I'm just dropping makeup all over too. <laughs> I want to do some lips. So actually, I think I'm going to go in with my Shine lip gloss and what's the name of this? This is the Admired lip gloss. It's really, really pretty. I just got this. I haven't worn it yet, actually, so it's pretty new. But I'm going to put this on. It is so pretty. They all have really nice names, too. Appropriate names too if you're like younger and you want to buy makeup too. So I would get in the So there's some makeup out there that has like crazy, crazy names. And if you're like a younger person, then like the names are just not like appropriate. And like your parents don't want you to make it, but it's like not appropriate names. So I really like that thing about Shine. Okay, so this is my makeup look. And I kind of just went for like my everyday makeup with a little bit of a twist because I don't always wear like the darker colors on my eyes and then I don't always wear a lip gloss on like the daily. But 
now that my hair is done, I just used some clips for my hair, just kind of pulled it back a little bit, and I will just show you guys my outfit, and then that will be it for this video, and I hope you guys are liking this video so far. Okay, so this is the finished look. I wanted to show you guys a little transformation, so I'm just wearing my turtleneck. It's from the thrift store, originally from Target. This adorable dress, actually from the thrift store, I think it's originally from JCPenney, it has the name by the Johnson, so I think they sell it there. And then I just have some tights on and some really cute boots, which I'll show you guys. But this is just the look, and then I put my hair in a couple of clips. My hair is still currently drying a little bit, but I really like this look, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video of me transforming and kind of glowing up for the day for 24 hours. And yeah, I really like this look. I think it's cute with the turtleneck and the little uh, spaghetti strap dress. I really like this kind of trend. I think it's adorable. So these are just my shoes. Yeah, there's snow on the floor because I actually tried to film earlier outside in the snow in my outfit, but it was just too cold, so I came inside. But these are blush pink boots. So I hope you guys really enjoy watching this video. That is going to be it for my 24-hour glow of transformation. If you'd like me to do more of these videos or other kind of transformation videos, then just let me know. I also got a wig from Amazon, and so I'm thinking I might do a transformation of that, but I'm not going to tell you guys what it is yet, so that'll be pretty fun. But I hope you guys really enjoy it, and I'll see you in my next video. I love you so, so much. Bye!